I'm Jesse Janae, founder of Lumi, and you're watching Unboxing Things, a show all about unboxing things. But instead of talking about the things, we talk about the box, because here at Lumi, we make packaging. So let's see what's in my mailbox today. Ooh, oh, oh, it's a big one. Uh-huh, okay. <laughs> today on the show, we have M.M. LaFleur. M.M. LaFleur is a direct-to-consumer women's apparel brand that sets out to make dressing for work easy and classy. Their model is super interesting. You can log on their site and buy any of their pieces individually, or you can have them use their taste, and they have great taste, to put together a curated bento box for you. This is a beautiful box and so fitting for a classy, elevated fashion line. They've put a die-cut handle onto the top of the box. I can punch this in and grab and hold this like a briefcase instead of lugging it around. Right in the middle there, small, it's printed the URL, mmlafleur.com. So I could be like holding my bento box with one hand, looking up the website with the other, like a real working lady. I'm actually going right now. And they've created nice crop marks for where the actual shipping label goes. This is cool because it means in fulfillment, it's almost like a guide and the shipping label will end up the same place every time. What else can I tell about this box from the outside? Well, it's an RETF, which means roll end tuck front. So the flaps tuck in the front and that means that I only need one piece of tape to actually keep the box closed. White ink on craft is super classy and beautiful and this is really well executed but you can tell that boxes do have a long ways to go and sometimes they get a little bit dirty so it's something to consider when you use light colored inks. This smells professional. Let's see what flute this box is made out of. So I find an exposed piece of corrugate and I can use this to actually test and oh yeah it's the beef flute. Beef flute is an e-commerce favorite. Super sturdy, cuts clean, all around nice. We're gonna open this box up. <sighs> Drum roll, please. You just find it's fine. Do whatever you want. <sighs> oh my god, you guys! <laughs> they wrote me a poem and they printed it on a box. Cut to the chase. Turn on a dime go out on a limb, knock their socks off. This is like a mantra for my entire life, essentially. <laughs> because Eat and Bento, it's all about organization and kind of everything having its little place. And that's exactly what I'm experiencing here. So there's actually a corrugated tray and they've got items in other pieces of packaging. They also have some really incredible and classy collateral. So this is like a welcome. It all begins with a Bento. Oh man, it's addressed to me. It says, hi, Jesse. I enjoyed putting your box together and I'm excited to work with you. Dossier of Remarkable Women. <sighs> you guys, there's women in here with stories. They all have impressive careers. I'm experiencing like genuine emotion and I haven't even touched any clothes yet. I love how they're bringing pivotal elements of their brand and their values into their collateral. What have I got here? Oh, okay, perfect. I've got a returnable poly envelope with a return shipping label already affixed. If I don't decide to keep everything, I will put the rest into this poly envelope. I can just throw that puppy back in the mail. So I'm gonna open this little drawstring bag and there's a belt inside. Like if that belt was just in here, it'd be swimming around, putting it into something that I get to unwrap. This is something I can keep. And same thing here. So they've got a nice little classy box, craft to match the rest of my experience. And in here is a really beautiful piece of jewelry, but I'm putting it away because here's what I care about. I care about this tiny box. It's so cute. And it lets me unwrap each item as opposed to just opening the box and seeing everything right away. I'm gonna go to the next layer now. Immediate, one-handed operation. I love you, love you so much. I can't even tell exactly yet what I've got here because there's a beautiful, beautiful and super silky bag in here that is holding all of my garment items. And so when I take this out, this bag protects all of the garments. I will keep this bag from many moons. Oh no, you guys. How do I tell you this? The bag looks beautiful from this side, but Bam! This big M is like such a great pop of branding. I'm just, I'm very impressed. It actually has a zip, so mm-hmm. It's a, it's a smooth sliding zip. So I'm finally to my clothing items, and so I can just go boop. That was the most satisfying ribbon opening of my life. And the way it shimmers. There is so much care and attention to how these items are folded in fulfillment. And when you look, there's actually tissue paper in between the garments. And then each garment has a tag with instructions about how to return so you know exactly what's going on. There's also product details and styling advice in here. I have to move you now, clothes. 
Ah, back to the box. Hold the phone. Uh-huh. <gasps> it says in here, why are you reading this? You must be extremely detail-oriented. We've always liked that about you. I've never dated someone that understands me as well as this box, but it was also like this incredible way of burying magical experiences into your unboxing. This is at the very bottom. Let's break it down. Yep. All right. You can see that MM LaFleur has opted to print on both sides. All the logos on this side and then that messaging just for me on the inside. Two-sided printing is a little bit more, but they're making that investment really count. Let's also break down this insert. Hold the phone. I almost missed a critical detail for you guys. This Corga insert is a different flute than the external box. The external box has to be rough and tumble, but this is a delicate inner piece. So they've opted for a different flute, as I suspected. Got an E flute on the tray. Overall, pretty simplistic, but when all put together and assembled, creates that bento experience. I think it's time to roll in the recap. So, MM LaFleur's packaging is amazing because it's elevated. They've made choices to make sure that everything about the experience just feels a little bit extra. It's also intentional. Everything from that little staple to the way the collateral is, is just so intentional. And then it's organized. There's something really just nice and fresh about how everything is in its proper place. You might call it a bento, for instance. That's MM LaFleur Unboxed.